Welcome to Myler's Mods, ladies and gentlemen. So this is the Fort Nerf Fortnite Blue Shock. This is a flywheel-powered magazine-fed blaster. This is actually the second one of these blasters. The first blaster I got from Amazon, yes, both of these came from Amazon. The first blaster I got was damaged. The box was destroyed. The blaster didn't even function. The magazine was missing. Jam or a battery door was also missing. It had no darts, no QRL code, no nothing. It was just a broken blaster in a box. Yeah, it's like that with Amazon. So I sent it back and they sent me this one instead. Well, this one actually works, so we're good to go now. Okay, this blaster costs 40 United States dollars. Yeah, 40 bucks for this thing. Okay, this blaster runs on four AA batteries. This blaster, when I laid it over my chronograph, I was getting speeds of only about 70 FPS on a good day, which is pretty bad for $40, but it is what it is. It's a Hasbro product. I don't expect much from them anymore. Now, here's the fun part. I'm rather disappointed in this blaster, not because of the performance, but because of one thing, magazine compatibility. And I really hate to be a jerk or a douchebag or whatever. But I'm going to point it out to you. This is a worker magazine, okay? This is a worker 15 rounder. This magazine and the mag it came with are the only two that fit in this blaster. I'm not kidding you. This is an aftermarket 12 round magazine. It wouldn't fit unless I shoved it in there and then it felt like it was going to break. This is a regular Nerf 18 round magazine. Again, I had to shove it in there and it felt like it was going to break. This is a magazine from a Max Striker. This, this magazine goes in, but it falls right out. Same thing with the X-Shot magazine from the X-Shot Pro. The same thing with a regular Nerf 12-round magazine. I tested 10-rounders and 6-rounders, and nothing worked. The only thing that worked that I had were worker mags and the, and the magazine I came with. So for $40, you pretty much get a proprietary magazine-fed blaster. And no other way to buy extra mags for it because it has both. At least in China, a company from China, you could buy extra mags. You may have to track down a listing, but you could find them. That's really great. So let's see what else you get for your $40. You get 10 of their Fortnite Elite Darts, which aren't bad. You know, they're not the greatest in the world. We call them drunk, drunken eagles in the community. There's much better darts on the market than that. One magazine a blaster, and a QRL code to get this skin in the game. I mean, it's a rather nice blaster. It does feel good in your hands. It does have great ergonomics. It kind of looks like an M4, but not really. You know, it's got a big cartoony vibe of an M4, which is cool. I've got this blaster loaded with like nine darts or so. You know, it's it doesn't give out the best performance in the world, but I'll give you a firing demo. Again, I have to wait for the fly was just full all the way up because this is only double A batteries, but and I'm out. Now that was a mixture of the um, watermelon darts, there was a mixture of elite darts and a couple of the new um, Darts from the X Shot Griefer and the X Shot Skin series. Here, but this is what I was talking about with cross compatibility. Nope. Nope. Okay, and keep in mind this is the one for the X Shot, and this is the Max Striker. This is where your Hasbro 12 round mag. You have to slap to get it in. Same thing with this one. And this one doesn't even want to go. And this one as well. You gotta slap it to get it in. Which which definitely isn't good for the mag release or the blaster. I mean, it's just terrible. It really and truly is. 
just terrible. I, I would not recommend buying this product. I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. I really try not to give negative reviews, but this product is definitely a pass. Save your money on something else and spend your money on something else. I mean, hell, you can buy one of the new X Shot Blasters that costs 30 bucks, you know, the X Shot Pro, and you'll get much better performance and you'll have greater mob potential for less than a few dollars. So for $40, you'll have a 200 FPS blaster instead of this thing here that is that only takes the magic camera and a worker back. I'll put a buy link in the description below, but I suggest you people just pass on this one. You know, there, there are modification, there are cages for this thing from Buff Daddy Knife. However, this thing doesn't use a standard strike cage like you would think. No, this, this blaster is terrible. Just pass on it. Well, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching my review of the Nerf Fortnite Blue Shock. Until next time, this is Miles Mods signing off.